This screencast is taking a look at how to change the page layout of the pages in spaces that you own. So any space that you are an owner of, you are able to change the page layout or where the applications appear on the page. So this um, page here, if I click on the name of this application and start to drag it, we can then see the layout of the page. So that yellow box underneath this publication display shows that this is one column where this application could appear and if I wanted to drag it across to this one this becomes yellow and I can drop that publication over there. So this page layout is a 30-70 page layout. 30% column here and 70% of the space is taken up with this second column over here. Now to change our page layout we go down to the actions menu on the global navigation bar and scroll up to change layout and we get a dialog box that shows us all of the layout options for the pages that we have. So we've got a number of different options here and the default setting is this one here which is 30, 70 or a 30% column there and a 70% column there. If we were to change that perhaps to this one down here, one to one, where we get one column which is the full width of the page, the middle column is a 50-50 split and then another one column down the bottom and click save. We can then see that the applications on the page will change to fit into that format. So here we've now got the iframe at the top taking up the one space and a publication display which we could move down into that 50-50 space there. So we've got these two applications taking up the 50-50 space. Our blog is sitting here. And if we wanted to drag that down to the one at the bottom, the one space at the bottom, we would just keep dragging until that appears. And when it becomes yellow, we can drop that. So now we've dropped that blog into the one at the bottom. Now there's a number of page layouts to choose from and it just depends on how you would like the applications to appear on the page as to which layout you would choose.